Today I would like to introduce you to the new text-to-speech SSML editor, with which you can refine the voice with a few simple click without having to write an SSML tag yourself. In the toolbar above the editor we now have the options undo and redo. With this button you can delete the SSLM option. With break you can insert speech pauses. With say as you can adjust the voice output of the text. For example if you want to have a number pronounced differently, with emphasis you can have sentences specially emphasized. I'll show you an example in a moment. Then there is the audio option, with which you can insert an audio file at the beginning or at the end of your text. With this you can record your own voice, the text then appears in the text field. It is also possible to translate your entered text directly into another language. Now I will show you some examples of the SSML options. Create your own natural sounding voice overs from your text with text to speech. I will now insert a pause in the text here. To do this, I simply click in the text where the pause should be inserted. Then I click on break and enter the length of the break in milliseconds. Create your own natural sounding voiceovers. From your text with text to speech. As you could hear there was a little pause. We can change the break, to do this I click on the tag and then on break button again to adjust the break. Create your own natural sounding voiceovers. From your text with text to speech. That was the example for the break. I would like to remove the pause now, for this I mark the tag and click on the button to remove the SSML option. Now I'll show you how you can adjust the pronunciation of a text. Hello 1234. For example, you can have numbers or dates pronounced differently. Here we would like to have the number pronounced individually. Hello 1234. As you can hear, each letter is now pronounced individually. Here I use undo and redo once to show you this function. I want to delete the SSML option again, I mark it and click on the delete option. Now I'll show you how you can express your text differently. Highlight the sentence and click on emphasis and choose one of the options. Note that these and other SSML options are not available for all voices. You can see this by the fact that these options are grayed out in the toolbar. This is an important announcement. This is an important announcement. As you could hear the text was expressed differently. Now I would like to translate the text. As you can see I can translate my text into different languages. Then there is the option audio, with which I can play an mp3 file at the beginning or at the end of your text. It is also possible to adjust the volume. This is an important announcement. This is an example to show you how this voice sounds. To delete the audio file, I simply mark the audio file and press backspace on the keyboard. The last option is speech to text which allows you to convert your voice to text. Please note that currently only the language in which your browser is set is recognized. That was the SSML editor from VoiceOver Maker. I hope you enjoyed the video. And of course this video was also created with the VoiceOver Maker.